Hello uh, guys, welcome back to the end of the battle day never use the puppy today, but yeah, whatever, I'm 18, whatever, fine, I don't care. Well, I do care though, that the last time battle chapter 2 was in chapter 11 of today. Read chapter 12 of judges. Okay, so chapter. Jeff. Holy ass. Jeff. 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 Okay, I'm saying Jeff. That's the fucking chapter. The Ephraimite forces were called out and they crossed over to Zephaphon. He said to Zephtar, Why did you go to fight the Ammonites without calling us with you? We're going to burn down your house over your words. Jephthah answered, I and my people were engaged in great struggle with the Ammonites, and although I called you, you didn't save me out of their hands. When I saw that you wouldn't help, I took my life in my hands and crossed over to fight the Ammonites, and the Lord gave me the victory over them. Now why have you come up today to fight me? Jephthah then called together the men of Gilead and fought against Ephraim. The Gileads shot them down because Ephraim said, You Gileads are terrific renegades from Ephraim and Manasseh. The Gileads captured the fords of the Jordan and leaned to Ephraim. And whenever his father Ephraim said, Let me cross over, the men in Gilead asked him, Are you Ephraimite? If he replied, No. The other said, All right, say, Shibboleth. He said, Shibboleth. Because he could not pronounce the word correctly. They seized him and killed the fords of Jordan. 42,000 Ephraimites were killed at that time. Jeff turned to Israel for six years. Then Jephthah the Gileadite died and was burned in the town of Gilead. Ibzan, Elon, and Abdon. After him, Ibzan of Bethlehem led Israel. He had 30 sons and 30 daughters. He gave his daughters away in marriage to those outside his clan. And for his sons, he brought down 30 young women as spies from outside his clan. Ibzan led Israel for seven years. Ibzan died and was buried in Bethlehem. After him, Elon, the Zebulonite, led Israel for 14 years. Then Elon died and was buried in Ajalon in the land of Zebulon. After him, Ebdon son of Hilo from Pirathon led Israel. He had 40 sons and 30 grandsons. He were on several darkies. He led Israel for eight years. The, the Ebdon son of Hilo died and was buried at Pirathon in Ephraim in the hill country of the Emmetites. Thank you all for listening. It's been a pleasure. I am the Daily Daba. And this is.